Oh, hello, fellow hashtag gamers. I didn't see you there. As you know, we at Gamergate firmly stand against corruption in video games journalism. This is the latest in my long running series of videos in which I briefly take down the most corrupt video games journalists in video games journalism. Today I'm going to be holding to account Steve Hogarty, aka at Mr. Brilliant on Twitter, a so called video games so called journalist who makes a fool of himself on a regular basis. I mean, here's one sample tweet. Here's a picture of me in my black belt kung fu outfit, ready to take the fight to hashtag Gamergate nerds, hashtag bring it on. And then there's a picture of him in a karate outfit. Look at this fool. And the worst thing is, there's literally no chance whatsoever that he's joking. And Gamergate comrades can post thoughtfully considered responses to his tweets, but he just ignores us. Well, Mr. Hogarty, I'm going to read the most bulletproof reposts to your tweets out loud to you right now. You cannot ignore us any longer. Old Okaido replies, I've done real martial arts, and the first thing they ever teach you is that you do not use that for assaulting people. Spencer64 says, so does that mean at Mr. Brilliant is going to beat up woman of GG? So ironic, XD. Joshua Parr replies, nice robe, but I look tougher pink underwear. The, the in pink underwear, I think he means. And there's a picture of him um, in um, what's grey underwear, really, but with, with pink trim. Um, Matthias adds, Behold Steve Hogarty at Mr. Brilliant being wrecked again. So beta, he's out alphaed by a guy in pink on these. <laughs> Grey, really, but yeah, yeah. you can't trust a man in pink. Encyclopedia Dramatica replies, OMG, please don't beat up the internet. Hashtag internet tough guy. Follows that up with, LOOL. Like, like, lol, lol, lol. I you can't sweep us under the carpet any longer, Mr. Hogarty. On January the 12th, at Mr. Brilliant tweeted, I have been sent a very special envelope of evidence. Today at 1300 GMT, I am going to end hashtag Gamergate once and for all. Mark M447 comes straight to the fence with probably cherry picked garbage like the rest of what Garcia does. Face it at Mr. Brilliant, we've got nothing to hide. At Mr. Brilliant continued, I've opened the envelope. It contains very important revelations about hashtag Gamergate. This may take a while to sink in. And then there's a picture which says um, Gamergate is fucking dumb as hell. Uh, and there's a picture of a, of a, of a penis. 101 Fahey replies, well, that's about the level of discourse I was expecting. Sterius replies, great way to prove your point. Call something dumb, provide no evidence, and then draw a penis. Yup. Captain Cutleg replies, hilarity ensues when you call us childish and do this. You are a fucking idiot. Maddog 1993 sums up the situation as just the scribblings of an idiot. Can't believe I stayed up until 5am for this shit. G underscore money 2015 replies, please share in kind. Donations needed for five year old Ashley to undergo surgeries. Great cause. Actually, that's, that's not a relevant one, is it? I'm, I'm not sure what happens after that. It's mostly just images of fairy porn. You cannot win, Hogarty. On October the 15th, 2014, at Mr. Brilliant tweeted, Hashtag Gamergate is literally worse than an ISIS of Hitler's. I think you'll find we're figuratively worse than an ISIS of Hitler's, Mr. Hogarty. No more replies. Thanks for marginalising the death of millions. Keep up the good work. Who's next? Where will your crusade of terror end, Mr. Hogarty? On January the 7th, at Mr. Brilliant tweeted, Ha! Hashtag Gamergate is totally losing its shit over Intel investing in women and minorities in tech. Beautiful! We are not losing our shit! On November the 10th, 2014, at Mr. Brilliant tweeted, On the advice of my lawyer, I have now reported Hashtag Gamergate to the police for mocking my tweets. Have fun in prison! A voice for men, and it's about time we had one, replies, Hey, fuck you and your fucking lawyers. Agent underscore obscurity comes in with, You're contacting a police to go after a hashtag on Twitter? I don't buy it. In before, ha ha, I, I was just trolling you guys. <laughs> You've really nailed Steve Hogarty's stutter there. He's notorious for that stutter. Fate of Morality links to the tweet and captions it, See you fellow hashtag Gamergators in prison. Can I borrow a toothbrush? Men's Human Rights replies, Sweet Jesus, and using the handle at Mr. Brilliant. Too funny when someone that dumb thinks they're a genius. On April 2nd, at Mr. Brilliant tweeted, So hashtag Gamergators use my personal likeness in a video game without my permission. I am consulting with my lawyer. 
Sinister Mephisto tweets, Someone gave meaning to your pathetic existence. First thing you do is whine like a bitch. Ingrate. What's that, Nancy? Are you saying you support Gamergate? I think she... Oh, fuck it now. The Furious Mulatto tweets, Cry some more, faggot. We have zero tolerance for faggots, Hogarty. Osama Ben Hitler tweets, Jesus Christ, you're a fag. Bro Mouse says, A real man lets whose fists do the talking? I think he meant his, but it doesn't matter. Nancy, leave the lamp alone. Look how women expect us to treat them. Feminism has gone too far. On October the 2nd, 2014, at Mr Brilliant tweeted, I've had it up to here with hashtag Gamergate. I'm going to murder every hashtag gamer I see with my fists and legs. It ends here. Psycho Josh says, at Mr Brilliant, your username is quite inaccurate. Jay Goodmamon says, you can come try to kill me, ya fucking pussy. Decart96 says, an idiot journalist wants to beat me up. Holy shit, I'm so fucking scared. Hashtag sarcasm, you had me there, Dan. Kirkland replies, did you know nobody actually cares about hashtag the dress? No, seriously, we don't fucking care. Actually, that's in a to tweet about the dress, isn't it? Not, not game against so it's the, it's the dress. Which is white and gold, by the way, not, not black fucking PC liberals. I think has to be black with them. Super Jesus Rifle says, good fucking luck with that, at Mr. Brilliant, and then posts a picture of a gun. Uh, Mr. Hogarty did acknowledge this one. On October the 8th, 2014, at Mr. Brilliant tweeted, Hashtag Gamergate tweeted a picture of a gun at me as if to imply, I'm going to shoot a bullet out of this and into you. Which naturally caused a controversy, because he posted that gun, which a crazy stranger probably only ends as a joke, without the context of his own credible threat to murder all gamers, as if we can just expect the people who follow him to have seen his publicly posted tweets. As Chris M says, Wait a minute, this is absolutely awful. That man responded to illustrate he would defend himself from what he perceived to be a death threat. This is almost propaganda. Is this guy a journalist? Well said, Chris M. By the way, the first four words in Chris M's bio are Law Student Lib Dem. So we know he isn't going to willfully misrepresent the truth to suit his own agenda. Litum Complexo replies, I call your bluff. Why did you censor out the context if you weren't trying to hide something? Yeah, what have you got to hide, Goebbels? Is it secretly your username? Are you sending these threats to yourself? No, it's a real person, but we can't put it past you. We'll never surrender, Hogarty. Never. Jigsaw says, dot at Mr. Brilliant. The dots to ensure that his followers say it, he doesn't want them to miss out. Proof children shouldn't be allowed on social media. They start to think they are tough. It's true. Steve Hogarty is just a child at the end of the day, so we should go easy on him. Uh, oh, Jigsaw follows this up with um, dot at Mr. Brilliant. Please cunt, I'm a gamer and proud. Come to my house. I'll be the fucker laughing as I pummel your face. Night Saviour replies, my sides, L-M-A-O-Z. Oh God. Oh, good luck, Mr. Red Pajama Ninja. And why so serious replies, ha ha ha, are you serious? You are? Ha 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 ha